Doing an all-nighter requires a special skill, you know, a special mindset, special preparation for it to happen the way you want it to happen. So what is a night, you know, an all-nighter? It's when you spend all night preparing for exam, if you're a student or for a project, if you're working or a regular job or in, you know, a non-government organization, and why it requires special skills and rules and everything else is because, well, you already spent, you know, whole day doing a lot of things and you are now tired, you don't want to do it, your willpower is low, you're fighting your biology, it's starting to go to sleep, you know, and for you to combat all that and to, you know, study, which most people don't like, it's really difficult. So what most people do, including me, is take one of these, or two, or three, or maybe even more. And I don't recommend those, I actually hate those, those are poison, but sometimes the reward is greater than, you know, the cost, the risk, and then you have to do it. And then you have to think about why you're doing this, like why you're sacrificing a whole night, or you're also sacrificing tomorrow and the day after that, not only today. So that's like a thing that people don't think about when they want to do an all-nighter. So what I did is I slept for two hours and I meditated for 30 minutes thinking about why I want to do this, how I'm going to do it, the benefits of if I, you know, achieve this, what are like costs if I don't achieve this, then I... <coughs> Sorry about that. I prepare myself, you know, I prepare the baseline so whenever I don't want to do it, I can pull back and, you know, remind myself of why am I doing this. And I also, you know, implement some of the rules whenever I like feel sleepy or I don't want to do it. Then I'll take a short break and go listen to music, let's say 15 minutes or maybe less. Then I get all jazzed up and I, you know, feel motivated and then I'll go back to studying and then there's a problem. What if I, you know, continue just, you know, studying a little bit or listening to music and studying a little bit. That's why I implemented a cool down. Let's say for two hours, once I stop listening to music, I cannot, you know, play music one more time. And then my phone and other electronic devices are gonna be right here and then I'm gonna be in another room so I don't get distracted and then I have one project at my table and I'm gonna do that one until I'm done and I'm gonna go to the next one until I'm done and the third one until I'm done and hopefully if I can continue all of, not continue finish all of those before the sunrise then I'll sneak in 20, 30, 40 minutes, maybe even two hours of sleep, but it doesn't matter, like, I'm, you know, ready to do it even without the sleep, and that's it, so that's what I have to for, say for this video, mm -hmm. and the next one will probably be, you know, about what happened tonight, because this is my first time doing an all-nighter, and... Enjoy this video and I see you tomorrow. Bye.